morning. So last year, 2020, uh, I completed the AT, but when I got up to New Hampshire, I kept on running into people that were kind of from the New England area, and they kept on recommending this New Hampshire 48, which is the 4,000 foot or above mountains in the state of New Hampshire. Obviously there's 48 of them, so. I kind of added that to my bucket list last year. Um, I got home in September and uh, I kind of rested for a couple months. Uh, and then started getting the itch again. So I brought the guys up here to New Hampshire, Paul, Greg, JJ. Y'all may have seen a couple of them in videos from last year, but anyway, so <clears throat> I think last year I did 17 of the 48 just by being on the trail. And now we're uh, up here. We'll probably carry this out over this year and next year. But today we're on the, uh, I believe it's the Boncliffe Trail, so Boncliffe Ridge Trail, maybe. But it's uh, out of Lincoln, New Hampshire. 11 miles in, we'll camp, hopefully, and then 11 by, 
miles back out tomorrow. We kind of established a base of operations down at a uh, campground down in Lincoln. And they were real good to us. So, took 20 hours to get up here by car from Atlanta. And stopped in Boiling Springs where I had one of my best meals on the trail last year for breakfast and ate there again. I think these guys enjoyed it. Stayed at Lisa's Hostel, which is a, it's pretty nice. I enjoyed it. I give it a, a solid B for you guys that are going to hike the trail one day. And uh, had five bunks. And uh, it's pretty nice. Cheap, 20 bucks a night. So anyway, we're out here today and we're going to conquer hopefully three more mounds, Bond, Bond Cliff, and West Bond Mountains. So trail's basically flat uh, for nine miles, so the book says. And then uh, that last two, you start doing some, uh, so you have to use your hands to climb. So we'll see how that goes. But uh, anyway, I don't want to talk too much. just want y'all to be able to see what we got going on. So far, the guys are enjoying it. And this week, we're going to go back over the Franconia Ridge, which I think is one of the most beautiful spots in the world. And uh, I wanted these guys to see that so they'd keep coming back with me. Was, uh, like I say, this is going to be this year and next year thing. Uh, but we're just uh, enjoying it today. I think we're in shape. Uh, you know, last year, if you watched any of those videos, I, I lost over 40 pounds and uh, I think I found it. So, but I feel good today. I've still been exercising. So, anyway. Put it on your bucket list if you got a bucket list. Was, uh, this is a great place to be. So I'll keep showing you the views as I get them. So this is the part where they may not like me so much anymore. Where you guys been? <laughs> Got a little climb here for you guys. Is that where the trail goes? Yeah. Awesome. Cause I went around to the uh, left there and it's, uh, I think that's the toilet. <laughs> I think you're about to have an ow oh wow moment up here, Greg. But you got to earn it on a rock climb. You're serious? We're going straight up that? I came up right where Greg's approaching, right there. I guess this is the one at a time. Stay yeah, I think it's a single wide. Right where JJ, yeah, come on up. Throw them up. 
I'm filming, but throw them up. You go. I'd help JJ, but I'm filming. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm good. Be a second. Whoa. Can you just throw that stick up his throat? Oh, Our new oh. friend. How do you feel about being a YouTube star? <laughs> I like climbing rocks. <laughs> it's a good thing. <laughs> good job. It's not a terrible climb, Polly. Nah. Did you look out there? See where we're at? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. That's worth it. Awesome. Man, I don't know how I'm going to get down. Seriously, I don't know how I'm going to get down that tomorrow. Same way you got up? And we hadn't even summited yet. <laughs> Not too shabby. I'd call it right. Blueberries are still at it. <clears throat> yeah. Still sweet. I'm a fan. All right, so that mountain over there is Bond Cliff, which we already summited. We're now standing on Bond Mountain. Good view. Very statuesque over there. That West Bond over there almost looks like Twin Peaks. Delish. Breakfast of the gods. What you got there, JJ? Cheese enchilada. Only the best. Is that Mountain House? What's Here's that package? This one's Mountain House. Alpine. Oh. Yeah. That's garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Alpine. Only Mountain House for me. Mountain House <clears throat> does not take care of the vegetarian crap. Oh, really? Do you write him a letter? We should. What is that? Alpine. Lasagna? No, that's the mountain house. Lasagna. The only good one they make. That and chicken fajita bowl. Um, Sorry, mountain house. There's another brand. And they make uh, vegetarian curry. I've had that. And? It's very good. Is it? They make a the, curry out of chili. What's the brand? I can't think of it. It's not Give them a plug. Come two. on. Come on, you're on YouTube, it's man. Like Katmandu or something. Like it's got like a white yeah. background on the front. And kind of pink up at the top across the border. It's really good. Mm. I would never make it in advertising. You're doing great. All right, so today is day two. 
uh, still on the uh, still doing the bonds. The uh, we did uh, Bond Mountain and Bond Cliff yesterday. There's a side trail to West Bond right now, which is what we're on. We dumped our packs back there. Got up about six this morning, out of camp by 7.15. Uh, yesterday was tough. <clears throat> um, I don't know if it's the layoff or, I don't know, it's just that hard. Got this guidebook, <clears throat> said it was moderate. Uh, it's more than, it's, it's worse, so. Anyway, today we, uh, it's 11, it was 11 miles out. We camped 11 miles back today is the game plan. So, uh, I think we were all sore. Hips, knees, ankles, difficult terrain, a lot of rocks, boulders. So, <clears throat> anyway, we're probably 0.1 from West Bond right now. Uh, overnight, had great views yesterday. And uh, overnight clouds came in. 50% chance of rain, it's just misty right now. So, we'll see how it goes today. Back to the campground at night. I'll catch a shower. It's probably time. It's about to, uh, <clears throat> day five without one so yeah this time so anyway uh that's what's going on i think the sleep did us good what we got of it but uh anyway looking for a nice easy stroll back got all day to get 11 miles Touch the top of the cairn there to make it official. <laughs> Where's our other guy? Us. So far. Sure, I'm glad it's not hot. It's not. You made it, Greg. Living in the clouds today. Ain't a bad life, is it? Go on, my nails are getting short. It's harder than I thought. It just shows you can only go, only go so far and not get caught. Mm, I'm dying for more. I'm dying for more.
Okay, so we finished in sunshine today. Um, ended up being real hot at the end. And so we've accomplished three mountains so far. Bond Cliff, Bond Mountain, and West Bond. So we're happy with that. I do have to give you the injury report. So uh, it's not me. It's Greg and it's JJ. <laughs> it's Paul, but we won't talk about so, his. Paul, mosquito bites don't count, Paul. Fine. All right. A rash. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. I'll go first. Wait a minute. How do you flip this thing? I'm going to have to edit. All right. JJ, what do you got? All right. I got a lump here and a cut here. And how did that happen? Uh, just hitting against rocks, but I'm going over boulders, but I think I'll recover. Did you fall? Uh, well, I fell, but not there. So I think I'm good. Okay. Greg, let's see those feet. That's what your feet look like when you walk all day with your feet soaking wet and you get a blister. Nice. I have another one now. Okay, let's see that. This is, Paul's going to cut this one off. Paul, come cut this off. All right, let's do it on video. Yeah. You might need a close-up. Now, how did that happen, Greg? Uh, John was going too slow for me, and I fell on some rocks. Nice. Not really. I just fell on the rocks. Going downhill, not uphill. I saw it, and I was a little slow to the camera. But it was a good one. I promise everybody. <laughs> All right. Blue Hill. We'll be back out there very soon. JJ, do you want to tell your story? About my shoe? <laughs> yeah. Very yeah. slug. <laughs> JJ likes to pre soak his shoes before he gets walking. So. Well, we were taking a break and we were soaking our feet in the water, and I put my sneaker really close to the Raging River, and it fell in and started going downstream, and Paul had to jump into action to save my shoe. But it's completely wet. But it was rescued. But it was saved. What'd you do for Paul? Uh, Gave me a ride back to the campground. Yeah. <laughs> Still working out all the details, but... Uh... All right. As uh, good hikers, we had brought a medical kit. So we know what we're doing out here, everybody. What are you doing? You put it across this way. Mm -hmm. I put the bottom edge of the gauze on the track. Like that? Yeah. All right, everybody. If there's any firemen watching, that's how you do it. Paul, a former government employee, knows what he's doing. I save shoes, I can bandage cuts. There you go. All right, we're checking out, guys. Uh, we're going to go get some pizza.